in maths when we ask what is the difference in this case between 3 and 5 the answer we're looking for is 2. Children often interpret this question as meaning more of a general difference and their answers might range from the difference between 3 and 5 is 5 is bigger to the difference between 3 and 5 is 3 is made of curvy lines and 5 has a straight line on the top. We can see then that the concept of difference in mathematics is quite tricky for young learners. They need something more concrete and visual and meaningful. If I represent 3 and 5 visually like this, it's much easier to understand what is the same and what is different between 3 and 5. You can see that 3 and 5 are the same because they both have the number 3 in them, but they are different because the number 5 has two more. So the difference between 3 and 5 is shown above the pencil line, 2. The difference between 3 and 5 is 2. So I'm going to teach you a game called Keep the Difference. Uh, you can either download a, a game track from Freestyle Maths Facebook page, or you can make one like I'm doing now. If you want to make one, simply get a ruler, a pen, a big sheet of paper, and you need to make a parallel double track, like a tens frame, but longer. So this frame is going to go to at least 10 in length maybe to 12. So once you've got your track, you also need another player. This is a game for two players and you need some counters or cubes, things to lay along the track and you need a dice to determine how many things you need to put on your truck. Okay, so let's play. My turn first, I'm gonna roll the dice. Four, that means I get four counters and put them on my side of the track. One, two, three. One more makes four. Okay, your turn. Mm, you've got a two. So that means you've got to get two counters, put them on your side of the track. One, two. Okay, my turn. Two. Okay, two more on my side of the track. One, two. So I've got four and two, making six all together. And your final turn. We get two turns each. One, okay. There, you've got three, I've got six, I'm the winner. The winner is the person with the most after two goes. And you win whatever the difference is between the two numbers. So, the difference is three. So I win the three that are different. And the rest of the counters just get taken to one side and you use them to play again, if you want to play again. So I'm in the lead at the moment with three counters. You win the difference. This game is best to play three times or five times and see who has the most counters after playing it a few times. Keep following us on Facebook for more maths games, ideas and activities. See you soon.